Tonight, the search is on for the thieves who stole brand new cooking equipment from a Fresno business. The family owned restaurant used the new gear just one time before criminals took off with it. Action News reporter Anna Torreya spoke to the owner about how this impacts his future business plans. I'm preparing our uh, Philly cheesesteak, the original. At this location, we do about 25 to 30 large sandwiches a day. Wilson Tadros cooks and grills up sandwiches for his customers at Willie's Phillies in Northwest Fresno. But today, this sign is posted out front. That's because someone stole their brand new smoker Sunday morning. The smoker was parked outside the building on West Herndon near Highway 99. Coming to work yesterday morning, opening up, you know, just to get the day going, I notice it's not there anymore. Surveillance video captured this dark colored truck driving off with the smoker on Sunday morning. You can see the man come out of this dark colored pickup truck from the gas pump. Moments later, another person hooks up the smoker to the truck and drives off. Tadros was only able to use the new smoker once for a catering event before it was stolen. He tells Action News the crime hurts and not just because of the financial impact. When you're doing something like that and you cook it from from the heart, the food tastes way better. You know, and that's what we like to do here. Normally, there would be a sign out here telling people about that new tri-tip sandwich on the menu. But for now, that sign is sitting inside. Willie's Phillies had a catering job set for Tuesday, but the theft is now forcing them to make alternative plans. Hello. Customers are shocked to hear about what happened to Willie's Phillies. I used to have a restaurant. I know how hard it can be to make some money, and uh, it's a shame. Fresno police say they are aware of the situation, and detectives are looking into the case. Police could not confirm if the man and vehicle are suspects, since the investigation is in its early stages. But Tadro says he believes that the man captured on camera is responsible. He had this message. I want to drop it back off. No questions asked. We're cool with that. Reporting in Fresno, Anna Torreya, ABC 30 Action News.